So ever since Apple took away our favorite USB ports, SD card ports, and even display ports, and now Windows is taking our I.O. ports away as well, it has been frustrating trying to get everything you need. Well, Ogato has a brand new Thunderbolt 3 Pro dock, and we're gonna be breaking it down in this video. Hey, what's up? Sean here with Think Media, bringing you the best tips and tools for building your influence with online video. And I'm here with Jeff from Elgato. How's it going? Fantastic, man. Living life. <laughs> Living the life and super pumped about the new product releases that Elgato has been dropping here at CES. And in particular, the Thunderbolt 3 Pro Dock. So Jeff, what is the thinking behind there? And let's break down the features. Uh, so basically, uh, this is looking to replace the IOs that we've kind of lost recently with the you know past few years from the MacBook Pros. We have a lot. I mean, there's a lot of potential in the Thunderbolt 3 ports that the MacBook Pros have, but you know we're looking for those legacy ports still because accessory makers still haven't made that conversion yet. So it's like I still have SD card slots, I still have flash drives with USB Type A, and I, I need those ports uh, so I can you know do my job or you know go on with life and normal you know normally uh, you know just and have a nice workflow and not have to worry about all these dongles. So now with the dock, basically it recreates almost like a desktop experience uh, with your laptop. So once you get home, you can just you know set your MacBook down, plug in one cord, and that's actually going to power your laptop uh, with 85 watts of power. And then it's also going to give you all the I.O. Uh, that you could basically ever want. So on the front here, we have two USB 3.1 Type A Gen 1 ports. It's a lot to say, I know. And then we have a, a multi uh, a multi port here, TRRS jack. And then we have an SD and micro SD uh, port here for you content creators out there who want to get footage off of your your DSLR, your drone, your your GoPro, whatever. You can easily connect this into your computer now. You've got the ports back. And then on the back, we have a lot more ports. This thing can actually drive two 4K 60 monitors at once, which is great. So you really get that desktop set up with your laptop. And then we also have two USB 3.1 Gen 2 ports that can do up to 8 gigabits per second. And we also have another headphone port here that would you would connect to your speakers. But what's cool is, just like a desktop computer, is if you plug in a, a headphone into the front port, it'll automatically mute this just like you would expect. Well, I'm super pumped about this, especially to be able to go home and be able to plug in. But this also will work for Windows configurations as well. And let's talk about the price. Yeah, so it's three forty nine ninety five, and you know it's really great for Windows computers too. I would warn you that you know for the power, I would check with your particular model to make sure it supports power delivery over Thunderbolt because not all laptops do that. But you know I have a pretty particularly powerful Windows laptop myself, and you know they're kind of bridging the gap between what a laptop used to be and what a desktop used to be. And now I'm getting you're getting these really powerful laptops, and in conjunction with this product, you really recreate that desktop setup in a much smaller footprint in your home, so you get to kind of reclaim your space. Space. So I'm super pumped about Elgato's new Pro Dock. And actually, I use a lot of different dongles when I'm on the road, but that definitely seems like a solution for a home office setup or a business setup. And actually, we have a whole series about our standing desks and some of our home accessories and my desk setup. And if you want to check out some other videos, I'll link it up on the YouTube card and put that in the description below as well. Question of the day, what kind of dongle or dock are you currently using? What brand and do you like it? What, do, what are the pros, what are the cons? Let me know in the comment section below.